litmaps is another useful tool that will make our lives easier as researchers. Discover the world of scientific literature. Literature reviews software for faster research and discovery. Discover, visualize, share and monitor. Discover academic papers you didn't know you needed through the automated citation search. Visualize your search results in a lit map and see how the articles link to each other by tracing citations. That's also very useful to find new research related to your topic area. Collaborate with colleagues, share your lit maps and to social and export your lit maps to show your work and let lit maps monitor your searches in the background for new articles you might otherwise miss out on. Also very useful. Let's have a look at the pricing of litmaps. Lit litmaps for free, students, businesses, teams and organizations. So there's definitely a free option. You don't get literature alerts, but with a pro option, you'll get literature alerts. Basic search up to 20 inputs. Basic and advanced and unlimited inputs. Okay, so there is quite a difference between the free option versus the paid option. But let's explore it and um, see what the free option can provide us and if it's worth it. And then you can always consider whether you would like to enroll for the paid version. The next step is to create an account and log in. You can use Google for that if that will make it easier for you. I've logged in already and this is what it looks like on the inside. Let's go through each of these three functions. Seed discover map. We'll start with seed. Find an article. Let's find something. Let's look at this specific article and continue and create seed map. 17 related articles and gives you a seed map cited by reference oh, momentum map relevance so this a uh, fixed okay that is interesting so it says here that cited by shows who cited who and how these articles are connected to each other by the fact that they cite each other it also seems like the size of the the yeah. circle refers to the number of people that cited it so here it's cited by 408 people and this one has been cited by one. So that's quite interesting to see how it all relates to one another. So here you can also click on specific papers. You can add them to your collection. I created a collection that says cricket. And here we go. And this is a lovely way to find new research. Add to a collection. Brilliant. Okay, so the seed function is really relevant to see how papers are related to one another and even to find new research. Now it recommends use Discover to take this search to the next level. So let's see what that's all about. So that's our next option, our next function. And here we go. Select results you are interested in. We are interested in these two. Say finish. And here we can monitor the search. We'll run the search for you every week and notify you whenever new articles are matched. So when there's new articles matched to these two articles that I, I chose. We can create a map, visualize these results on a customizable map. And we can even dive deeper. Upgrading to LitMaps Pro will let you search target keywords, date ranges, and traverse millions of citations. 
that's interesting see create map and here we are again see how they link to one another who are cited to here you can remove from the map you can add to i guess to a collection to the map so you can even create your own map and add to discover uh, remove from the collection and you can even export it to bibdex csv or ris so that's now the citation also very useful so this and this is the map function so lit maps really let you visualize how these papers are interrelated i must say the seed function is quite useful to me i can see how one can find new research and add it to your collection and i think this is a good tool to explore a new research area and to see how research relates to one another so go and play around with lit maps and see what it can do for you if you found this video helpful smash the like button for more useful tips to boost your research experience subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below this video and while you're at it hit the bell so that you get notified whenever i produce a new video if you need a solution to a challenge not yet covered on my channel leave a comment in the box below see you in the next video